Hello sir, good morning, good day. So I have this is my video about the experiment of the water and its properties. So first of all I have there the materials. I have the salt, a sugar and also since I don't have any gelatin I have to jelly is food coloring and also the um, oil and the alcohol then I have there a six cup since I don't have um, 12 cups so I do first a um, water um, water and also the materials before that I will going to have a gas then for now I'll go for the water and the mixtures of this material so this I'm going to put the water okay this one a half a half water in the cup okay then after this I'm going to determine it is soluble or insoluble okay so I'm done putting so the first thing I'm going to put is the sugar okay so I'm going to do this putting the materials and mix it then I'm going to identify it is soluble or insoluble okay so this is the salt I'm going to mix it okay uh, for a minute lang so I'm going to put this sugar okay after I'll putting all the materials I'm going to mix it so the gelatin no. then I have there a food color and oil this is oil so our oil is put in the cup so I'll put it then I have there a alcohol this is 70% okay uh, this is our alcohol sorry this is only uh, used bottle but oh. okay now I would like to describe it is soluble or insoluble so the first thing is we have salt okay I'll mix it okay since the salt is very uh, it was mixed on the water and uh, it was melted to the water so the water mixed to the salt it is soluble okay this is soluble the salt and the water is soluble now let's have the sugar okay yes also the sugar sugar melted to the water so this is also a soluble now let's have this the gelatin okay since the gelatin is not melted to the water and also the gelatin is not um, changed into textures so I'll put the gelatin on the water gelatin is still the gelatin did not change any mixture so this is insoluble okay gelatin are insoluble is insoluble to you now let's have this the food coloring 
Okay. So since the food color is melt to the water, so it is soluble. Okay, done. We have this the um, the oil, cooking oil. So I'll mix it. Okay. So the cooking oil is not uh, mixed to the water, it's not binded with the water. So this is the insoluble. Since the cooking oil and the water is not bind binded or mixed with, so this is insoluble. Then we have there the um, what we call the alcohol. This is 70%. So I'll mix it. Since the alcohol and the water binded together, so this is a soluble. Okay, so those are about the water. And let's have now the kisser. Now we have go with the gas. Then the reason why wala ko sulod sa balay kay this is the chemical in which flammable basig na yung mga accident mahitabo then mayabuyabo so I will not choose sa sulod sa balay so na ako ron diri sa gawas so now let's have the gas so this is the gas the same thing with the water I have na ko siya ibutang so I need to be careful kay this is very um dangerous things okay okay the same thing with the water and the same thing with the material then after putting those material i'm going to determine that it is soluble ba or insoluble so the differentiate lang any water or kanisi gas is this gas is very flammable and the water is and solvent is good for the all the things that need to be milk okay so i have there a salt sugar a food color gelatin the oil and also the alcohol with 70% of disinfectant so first thing to do I'm going to put the um, salt okay same things with the water a, a few minutes lang na ko siya after na ko i-mix para um, na siya koan gamay nga mahitabong melting the materials Okay, the um, sugar. Okay, then we have the gelatin. Okay, then we have the food color. We have the oil. Oops. And lastly, we have this alcohol. Okay, combining with the alcohol and gas, it is very flammable. Okay, um, Alcohol also flammable things. No. Then, then now, I'm going to determine it is soluble or insoluble. So let's have first the sugar. See, so I do memorize this all uh, materials and with gas. So na memorize man ako, so I can go with nala. So the first thing we have the salt. Okay. So I see there that the salt it's also melting to the gas so it is soluble. Then we have the sugar. 
yes it's very slowly to melt but the melting process is ongoing na. okay also melting siya. so it is soluble so the mixtures the water uh, the gas and the sugar is also melting so it is soluble now we have the gelatin yes I mix it but the gelatin is still on the textures there is no um, um, changing of the texture so it is insoluble now we have this the food color so so I um having the experiment then i have also take note those answer or identifying it is soluble or insoluble okay the food color and the gas yes it is melting and um changing the textures of um food color so it is soluble okay now we have the oil and the gas so I need to be careful it because this is very dangerous okay I'll mix it and the oil and the gas is not binding well so this is insoluble because they are not binding with so but they are mixed I'll try to mix it but they will never buy, bind the gas in the oil uh, that's the reason that insoluble so now let's have the alcohol and the gas so after this experiment I, I need to throw it for us to be safe okay I'll mix it with the gas and the alcohol so they were binding together and they, this is soluble okay those are the water properties that I would like to show to you and differentiate whether it is soluble or insoluble okay thank you I'm done with the water and its properties so now I have the water is a good for biochemical reaction so I have there a vitamin C and also a baking soda and a water okay so the first thing I'm going to do is a vitamin C so I'm going to um, powderize it so so I'm done powderizing it so that is so I'm going to get some of the vitamin C okay this is okay so after that um, I'm going to have this baking soda so okay Okay. Right. Going to mix it. Then I have a water. I'll put the water five spoons. One. Two. Three. Four and five. Okay, then after that, I'll mix it. Okay, it's take a few minutes, but okay, I still mix it. Since the vitamin C is the water soluble, so let me see if, if it is soluble okay I'm going to mix it yes there is a changes because it is there is a process of melting okay 
<clears throat> there is a little um, changes okay okay now I am describing that what happened to the mixtures of the vitamin C, baking soda, and the water. Okay. The baking soda is melt to the water and also the vitamin C because the vitamin C is the water soluble. Okay, I see it. Okay, I see it that the baking soda and the vitamin C is melt to the water okay and there is an a changes of the sub substance okay, okay let's have a final oh. the textures of the um, baking soda and the vitamin C is changing and melting and I did not see here the vitamin C in the baking soda and that's the reason that the baking soda and the vitamin C is insoluble material soluble to the water and that's the reason that the vitamin C in baking soda is melting melt to the water okay and that's all now we have the properties of water solution so i have there the lemon and also the um what do we call this starch and also i have the what do we call this it is a panel and salt and also i have a clear transparent glass so i'm going to do is to first mix the starch and the lemon wow and i'll mix it and there is a reaction with no you see that there is a reaction okay there is a tiny bubble with the starch and the lemon so there is a reaction with the chemical okay then oh have you see that oh it's making a bubble there is a what do we call this okay it's melting yes then i'll add the water okay i'll put the water then i have there a panel then as well Okay, I'm going to do is to put there. Okay. For a few minutes, we will gonna know what 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 happened to the starch, lemon, and the water. So I'll add water. Okay. Wait for a minute for a few seconds. Okay. Okay. After doing this, I'll observe what happened. Okay, it's already done. I try to have observe what. Okay, I'm going to press. Okay. Oh, the starch is melt here. So the starch is none there so it's already mixed or already 
milk to the uh, calamansi juice in the water. And that, yeah. Not good. So, it was melting. So, I see it look like a calamansi juice. A mixture of water in calamansi juice without knowing that there is a starch being mixed here. So, in all, in conclusion, that the starch are milk to the water and the um, calamansi juice. And that's the reason that there is a happening of chemical reaction. There is, this is unsoluble. No? There is a changing of chemical, uh, there is a changing of textures and also there is a rearrange or chemical reaction. It have the homoses, okay? When I watch the video, I have the guide on how to do it. So, I'm going to put salt. I have their salt, sugar, water, and the already cut potatoes this one so so the first thing this is the salt okay. the sugar and the water the one without any materials put it so now I have their already cut potato then I'm going to put the potato on the water with the salt water with the sugar and only water let's see what happened what is there is a reaction or this is a changing of color what happened to the potato I'm going to define after um, three minutes let's wait and three minutes then I'm going to tell you what happened to the potato okay after I'm going to describe what happened to the potato being mixed with the solvent and those with the water with salt sugar and water so I'm going to answer the question that um, enumerate the different function of water in living system so the function of water in the living system are on the biological level and also the water role as a solvent help uses to substance so that's what I'm going to show a well uh, a well ago the water is very useful for just like having this like of experiment so this uh, water is is a good solvent or is a useful solvent that we are going to have experiment so we have this number two so based on your observation so after after I'm going to tell you about so later I'm going to describe what happened so there are so I'm going to define the dialysis and osmosis so what is dialysis so dialysis is the excess fluid move from the blood to the dialysis through the membrane until the fluid level is the, the same between blood and the dialysis so that is dialysis now what is osmosis so the osmosis is the fluid move from the areas of high water concentrate to low where water concentrate across the semi permeable membrane until equilibrium is reached so that is the definition the dialysis in osmosis now I'm going to describe what happened to the potato being mixed to the water with salt sugar in the water so I'm going to have to see that yes the salt is melt to the water and yet the potato is 
changing the color or changing the color so there is a reaction the potato is changing to color so it's look like that the potato is made to what do we call that is loose pot in Visaya so that is the color of the potato now let's have this salt uh, the sugar yes the sugar is now to the milk to the water and yet the potato is is changing also the color no yes the potato is changing into new color just like um, is going to slightly brown like that yes that is the color of the potato that I'm put it in the sugar yes there is a changing with the potato and there the, this is no mixtures the water only the water in the potato so let's now see that what happened to the potato and a few minutes I see that the potato there is no changing yes there is no changing of the potato still the potato yes change of the textures kay ako ma siyang gikat I cut it and that's the reason nag shape uh, nag change siya og shape but there is no changing of the color still the color of the potato only the salt sugar lang ang nag change but the water there is no changing well so that's all about my experiment and thank you for um, watching and listening and hope you understand and learn new things that being to learn about the biochemistry thank you and all about this I'm going to keep it but you will not see because I'm going to have off the camera thank you and god bless and once again good day